All right. So we're going to travel the trail. By the way, welcome to the Oregon Trail. Uh, this is 1.2. I'm Skybills. You might remember me as the girl who ran Oregon Trail 1.0 on the Apple II last year. I want to present the joy of Oregon Trail 1.2 because it's got a lot of features that Oregon Trail uh, 1.0 doesn't have, and I want to be able to share that everyone. Plus, you know, SGDQ chat did not die last year. <laughs> that is something we need to change. So come with me to Oregon and let's have some fun. All right, so we're going to be the doctor this time because we can bring people back from near death. And I'm going to be using party members that we will be using at SGDQ. Bring up a little text here. All right, so this is going to be, here are the 2016 candidates. We have the Sky Brigade, the SMW crew, the RGL crew, and of course, the ever so living SGDQ chat. All right. So we're gonna leave, we're gonna take the uh, the safe route here and leave in May. We're gonna do 20 oxen. We're gonna do 50 sets of clothing. And we'll go with 10 boxes of bullets. And since this is a marathon run, two of everything. And we're also going to do, let's call it 1,500 pounds of food. Actually, let's do a little less than that. Uh, let's do one of every, and we'll do five boxes of bullets here. We'll go with 1250? Nah. We'll go with 1000. My formula is very different for this one. I have to remember from the first one. We're going to eat meager meals. And we're going to go on, of course, a ruling case. Here we go. Nice little music feature here. I can't help it. We might have to get someone with a guitar or banjo for a donation incentive here. Oh, one day it's lost. It's fine. And uh, we will always take the ferry across and wait because marathon safe route, of course. Now, optimally, if we were going for world record, we would float the river across, but we're going to avoid doing anything less than what is necessary. That is, we're going to use all the special features like we did last time. Ferries, um, hiring an Float it. We got it. We don't have any other choice here, but we're looking good. We're looking good. Everyone hold hands. All right, we got it across. Let's keep it going. We're not going to ford the river, no. You never ford the river, ever. Bad idea. It's a good way to get yourself killed on the Oregon Trail. And man, this fog today. At least we can hope it's fog. Hey, John Carlson. All right, we're gonna keep going here. <laughs> it's gonna be so much fun to do this. And again, I would definitely, if we know someone who plays guitar, do this to keep playing this tune live here for the crowd, because why not? Piano might work too. So we're going here. We have a middle wagon wait, by the way. Oh, SMW crew suffering from exhaustion. Middleweight, and that's a little different from Oregon Trail 1.0. I normally we would try to have this wagon be as light as possible, but to keep a marathon safe route, we're going to stray from that. You've played guitar most of your life. Good deal, John Carlos. It's like, no, kill it for food. Not doing bad so far, we're just traveling here. Helps a little poor, but, you know, 
that speaks to fact on the Oregon Trail. Oh. Keep it going, Oxen. We're going at lightning speed here. No, the axe died. Can we kill it for right now? Wait, it's already dead. These updated graphics, absolutely. We're, we're beyond pixels now. Let's go to the Green River Crossing. You never want to go and buy supplies. You always want to take the fastest route possible. And for those of you wondering, yes, this is the same hat that I wore during last year's run. So, as a W as well, you have both this board. And then we are going to take a ferry across, and yes, we will wait the two days. Now the ferry can still crash, but the odds of that happening are slim to none. And again, always just taking the safe route across, um, because river crossings are some of the most hazardous things that can happen. Um, you could lose your entire crew, you could lose all your oxen, it's just, it's ridiculous. And of course, again, we never ford. Look at this, the, the, the SGD huge hat is, is not that you know, there's something seriously wrong with this state of affairs. Wild fruit's good, adds to our food. Bad for speed, but very good for marathon safety. Alright, pass those strings, that's good. No grass for the accent, no. <laughs> should take a bus. No, this is the Oregon Trail. We take covered wagons and head west. Because if they, you want to know why they went in wagons and went west? Because if they went east, they would have drowned. I know, horrible. Horrible. Alright, we re replaced it from supplies. That's why we travel with one of every supply here. We don't have our Tim the Toolman tailor here, sadly. Nobody here knows how to fix a wagon wheel. RGL, standing for Retro Gaming Live, one of my other Twitch teams. During some of the longer stretches, by the way, if there's, um, I will explain like kind of the mechanics of this game, similar to what I did with 1.0, but um, I will make sure to get the, uh, the crowd revved up for this, because why the heck not? And again, if we have the uh, everyone sitting on the wagon, they can make comments. Make sure I make the right option here. There we go. Um, we can have donation readings. We can have someone playing guitar. We can have the couch kind of talking and making fun of each other. All sorts of fun things we can do during this. We are almost ready to Oregon here. Across the last river already. And again, if I was taking the absolute fastest route, I could be done by now. But again, safety is always an important thing. Finishing the run is always an important thing. So we're going to do that. Also, in this run, food can spoil. That's a very scary thing to think about, and the game randomly um. generates it. So we always have to keep a little bit of extra cash just in case that happens. Oxen are traveling as fast as they can. Health is very poor, but we're gonna keep going. The oxen are getting more sick than we are. Maybe the health of the oxen is very poor. Oh, my own crew is suffering from exhaustion. That's no point. Come on, we're almost done working on guys. Yeah. And we're gonna go to the Dells, and we will take the toll road from here. auto scroller down the river just because a it's slow and b just way too many things can happen there so naturally we will take the toll road that's the second ox that's dead here look at this more than enough food to go around though um i believe the 1000 isn't too bad and uh, on medium rations not bad at all more than enough food to go around even if it spoils take the toll road
again, the estimate on this would be 15 minutes on the event. Uh, something really weird happens with the parts, there's a punch, etc. I leave that time open for a reason. The estimate here is being very generous. <laughs> oh, my own brigade died at the end. Rip. Rip by Oregon, guys. I am disappointed. And again, SGDQ chat comes down with nothing. Beautiful. But that's it. Um, we had four people arriving. Awesome. Um, points don't really matter quite as much, but we had four people survive, which is great. You know, we had four lives left. So this has been Oregon Trail 1.2. And again, there's a lot of fun things we can do to arrange for this. We can find someone for guitar. Um, talk a little bit just about Oregon Trail in general. Um, just a couple things I want to point out at the end here. Um, the supply list we had, I'm going to manipulate it a little bit just to make sure um, generally what happens in a run and uh, kind of adjust. I think I picked up too many pairs of clothing there, so we're going to save a little bit of money there and buy just maybe a little bit more food. We have to make sure the wagon weight is not too heavy though, so we're probably going to stick to one or two of each wagon part just to be safe there. So a couple point outs there for that, but uh, I hope you guys had fun and I hope... Um, you guys will consider this, especially for the Silly Games Done Quick Block. Thank you so much again for watching this, and again, estimate of 50.